Here I am, Castle Gar, drink it in. This is our Kootenai Canal generating station. I'm here to learn more about the clean power we generate here with the plant manager, Thomas Bear. Let's go check it out. Thomas, thanks for having me here. My pleasure. Now, Kootenai Canal, I want you to tell me what do I need to know about Kootenai Canal generating station? Well, Kootenai Canal was built in the mid 70s and uh, Part of the reason why they decided to build Kootenai Canal was due to the Columbia River Treaty, which regulated the water going into Kootenai Lake with some of those treaty dams. Okay. And because the water is now regulated, it made this project feasible. Okay, now it's a canal. Is that a pretty unique setup on our system? Yes, as a matter of fact, there's only one other canal throughout the system, I believe in Seton. It's 4.8 kilometers long. 4.8 kilometers of canal, wow. That's correct. Now what about the power you generate here at the generating station? Can you tell me how that works? Yes, yeah, so we take the water and we run it down through these four penstocks. We run them through Francis turbines and all of our electricity goes into the grid. How much power are you generating here? Kootenai Canal is currently the sixth largest power producing facility in BC Hydro. The energy that you're generating here it's nice clean energy, isn't that right? That's correct. It's a beautiful spot. I'm looking forward to checking out more of Thomas, if you'll have me, I'd love to go check it out. That would be awesome. All right, stick with us. I'm coming to you from Hugh Keenly Side Dam in Castle Gar. I'm in the navigation lock control area, high above the lock. The lock is the only one in Western Canada. It actually opens up to allow boat traffic, lumber, whatever needs to pass through the facility, get through safely. So it's a really cool facility and I'm excited to go and check out the lock in more detail. Hugh Keenly side is a storage dam. Now what a storage dam does is it allows us to control the flow of water and prevent downstream flooding. Behind me are the spillways and that's where we can release water when we need to. I'm on the downstream side of the lock and you can see the tugboat retrieve the load of lumber that's passed through the facility. Much in the same way, Hugh Keenly Side Dam is tugging at my heartstrings. Now, I want to go and see some more of the beautiful sights here in Castle Gar. I'm excited to check out all that this great community has to offer. Let's go.